And it's post time for the eighth race, second elimination, two-year-old Colt and Gelding Pacers. Top five finishers make the final. They're at the post, and here they come. And they're off. Brandon's Cowboy from the outside for the front. Scallywag Hanover pacing out well. Times are changing right there on the inside. And Brandon's Cowboy powering on for Jim Morrill trying to clear the field. Getting away in fourth is the Preacher Pan under some early urging. Driven to win is fifth in behind him. Incredible Toy thought about leaving, but he's backing up on the outside. Western Affluence slides up now in sixth. And racing in seventh is Rampant Dialing as Incredible Toy trails. And times are changing. Moving early from third for Luke. Opening quarter in 20. 28 and 1. Brandon's Cowboy in front, but not for long because times are changing as just brushed around him. And here comes the Preacher Pan as Miller revs him up for a backside bull rush for the lead. And the Preacher Pan is hustling hard on the outside, and he has just taken command from times are changing. Brandon's Cowboy is back in third. Scallywag Hanover following in fourth, driven to win, showing the whip from fifth. Western Affluence is sixth. Rapid dialing, trying to get some cover flow going. Incredible Toy slides up to his inside. The half is up in 56 and 2. Identical 28 and 1 quarters so far. And the Preacher Pan is on the lead onto the far turn. And Scallywag Hanover has been flushed out first over. And he's coming quickly for Andy Miller on the outside. Scallywag Hanover right at the throat of the Preacher Pan. And he pokes ahead in front as they near the three quarter marker. Driven to win in a perfect striking spot. A second over on the outside. Times are changing as locked in at the rail. Shuffled back as early leader Brandon's Cowboy. Western Affluence third over. Three quarters, 125 and three. The Preacher Pan and Scallywag Hanover driven to win. Kicks off cover trying to come on. Times are changing with a peek at the pylons there. Western Affluence kicking out the plugs trying to come on on the outside. It's driven to win who has a short lead. Western Affluence on the outside. Times are changing up the rail. Driven to win trying to hold on. Times are changing on the inside. These two very tight. Driven to win may have gotten it from Times are changing. 153 and two. Elimination and Meadows Kingpin Dave Pallone has joined us and Dave driven to win. I look at those lines here. I saw one other Dave Pallone performance, a rousing victory there in 51 and 4 at Lexington. What do you remember about that race and what did you take into tonight? Well, we kind of fell into the same kind of trip as we did down there. Bobby caught a good second over and uh, my cover carried me. He's just a nice little horse. Uh, they'll have to make a mistake next week probably for him to go with the good ones, but uh, he's always there. He answers every week and he's got a little more go than he shows. Best quality for him. Uh, he seemed like he was fighting at the wire there. They're all coming after him. Yeah, he's got some dig to him. He's not real good off the fence. Uh, I didn't get away as good, but when I got David in front of me, I thought that was going to be my cover, and he moved back to the front and uh, waited on Andy, and it worked out. So we'll see you here next week for the, for the Breeders' Crown Final? I hope so. Any other Meadowlands plans in your future, possibly? No, that's it. Okay, Dave Pallone. We tried to get him to answer that one, but we couldn't get it. Dave Pallone, driven to win. He just, just that here, and paid 5-1. to one.